We have almost 200 animals. Good boy. We have alligators, crocodile, we have caiman, tortoises, turtles, lizards, frogs. So you are at Alligator Attraction Wildlife Learning Center. They have 80 teeth. Our animals are pet surrenders. They do need interaction, so it is essential for them to have interaction every day. Like squash, cucumber, carrots. My main dream is to educate the population on everything that we have, whether it's our alligators, which are natural to Florida and they're good for our environment, to the exotic pets that are surrendered or needed to be rescued. We have stingrays, sharks, snakes, tarantulas. They will pop out of their skin entirely. He trusts me to not hurt him. You can either come in and see them and interact with them, or you can actually learn about them before you get this. This is still a very dangerous animal. We want you to be able to touch and feel and be up close to an alligator in person, not in the wild. So you don't want to feed the alligators in the wild. We reinforce that. So this is Porky, a skinny pig. Education is key. The more you know, the more you can take with you. And their bite force is about 200 PSI. The more our ecosystem is going to be safe. He is a finnick fox. It excites me that all ages come in and take something away. Those are so cute. Okay, and by cute, I meant the cute fuzzy ones with, you know, not necessarily <laughs> the ones with the everything. scales. Hey, this rescue also does virtual field trips, and they can tailor the experience to a teacher's lesson. They are open from 10 a.m. until 7 p.m., Monday through Saturday, and 12 p.m. to 7 p.m. on Sundays. Fine, the alligators are a little bit cute, too. That does.